Welcome back. Your business news now, courtesy of Mike Apple. Good morning. Hello. Good morning. How are you? I'm good. How was the weekend? It was all right. Yes. Relatively uneventful. That's yeah. a, that's okay. You know, uneventful Didn't... sometimes is all right. <laughs> it's sometimes nice. You need it, right? That's right. You reset. Gotta, you know, just, that that's exactly right. It's a reset. There you have it. Okay. Slept a lot, read a lot, I've watched a lot on a lot of things on television. Oh, we'll talk about that after. I binged through all of Is It Cake, all of it. It was amazing. <laughs> it was so good. Okay. okay. You're like, I'm not interested in that. Continue, Melanie. That we have business to do. Okay. Let's get let's get to some big news. <laughs> We're expecting the Ford government to table legislation when it comes to cutting the gas tax. You know, a lot of people questioning timing on this one. So mm -hmm. let's let's break this down on what is anticipated. Well, they've all been talking about this since the last election campaign. So uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, and, and the other thing about this 5.7 cent per liter reduction in the gas tax, which uh, won't take effect until July 1st and then ostensibly lasts for six months. So it's a temporary reprieve on the uh, gas tax to some extent. Um, the premier previous uh, prior to this was saying, well, they'll do it if the feds do it and the feds haven't done it. So they're kind of uh, going it uh, alone and saying they need the the well, ostensibly three months for the companies to adjust their uh, their taxation from the province, which subsequently would have to be readjusted after six months. So the the timing of July first, uh, of course, there are politics. There's politics involved with this, Melanie, and uh, we'll see that legislation and questions to the premier later today as General Motors is uh, set to unveil some new uh, things at its uh, test track in Oshawa later this morning. And of course, uh, you know, they've taken and or have sent all those rebate checks related to the uh, license stickers. Mm -hmm. The tolls on the 412 and the 418 are coming off tomorrow. Where's all this revenue coming from all That's of a sudden? That's the question, yep. It's going to be a very interesting spring budget for this this province to see exactly what the offset is for government coffers, because last time I checked, uh, over the past couple of years, the uh, government's racked up a whole lot of debt and still has some big bills to pay with, uh, you know, uh, uh, of course, sp spending on things that need to be spent money on and some pretty big contracts likely uh, coming due in the next couple of years as well. No doubt. Uh, and yeah, we're about two months away. Just under two mm -hmm. shy of uh, heading to the polls, so go. a lot to talk about there. Yeah. Um, so the money you mentioned, and perhaps it's coming mm -hmm. from legal online gambling as of today, Mike? Apparently. <laughs> I'm not a gambler, and I went, oh, yeah, right, that, that uh, legislation took effect today. Uh, so uh, these online gambling sites, which, look, let's face it, there's kind of been a gray market here. We've seen, you, you listen to the radio, you watch television, you see ads for um, uh, gambling web websites. And then they always put the .net as opposed to .com, the differentiation between uh, a site that you just go on and uh, fiddle around on as opposed to actually a transactional mm -hmm. with the uh, money changing hands. So there are a number of companies that have registered for and will be launching, if they haven't already done so, legal online gambling, sports uh, wagering, single game. I mean, the OLG's already got this to some extent. And again, the uh, the discussion is this could bring in upwards of $800 million to pro provincial revenue. Let's face it, that's a key here. And uh, there's going to be a whole lot of competition. And it's going to be very interesting, Melanie, because they kind of said the same thing about the cannabis industry back in the day. And uh, yeah, uh, kind of an oversupplied marketplace. So we'll see if this uh, generates a whole lot of new players to the, uh, the gambling website space. There. Okay, mm -hmm. very clever. Okay, Mike, we'll talk to you again tomorrow. We have run out of time. <laughs> okay. Lots to talk about. Talk to you soon. All right.